Yo, what is up guys? Um, today I will be showing you how to make um, thumbnails uh, like these. Uh, so yeah, let's let's just uh, get to it. Alright, so first uh, you want to drag in a clip, um, just to a normal uh, project. Um, then find where you want the thumbnail to be. So I'd like it to be here. You can see the name and you can see how much you damage and stuff. So just uh, cut this, uh, just uh, delete, uh, unlink from the audio and uh, change clip speed and make it freeze frame. Just like this and then just delete that. Now you have this, just delete the audio. Now you have this. So you want to add some effects so that this stands out and they want to you want to be some blur and stuff around so just search up zoom blur and add that you can already see that it's beginning to look like something um just change this to just so you can see the name and this the the damage that she does so probably right about here or maybe if you drag this up it can be more censored so that uh, you don't yeah, it makes it uh, easier to make the, the zoom. So just change this to maybe 0.3. Then change this to... I like to use anything between 1.3 and 1.35. So I'm just going to use 1.3. And then the next thing you want to add is sharpness. Uh... So you can you can use this as well, but yeah, it has all these all these things. So yeah, I use uh, sapphire sharpen because uh, that works uh, best for me. Uh, you can see it's already sharpened, but uh, we wanna turn that down a bit because it looks weird. Um, just uh, change this to maybe 0.5 or something, anything between. Just change it to 0.2, I would say. Just like this. Um, and yeah, that's actually pretty much it. Um, so we can do, yeah, we can do that one. Um, let's do a knock kill this time. So I'll take this in and find where I get the kill, of course. Uh, it should be right about here because a knock kill is going to be a bit later. So, right about here. So you can see the name and the damage. Um, yeah. Like that. And then make this um, freeze frame again. Delete this and this. And then you're back with this. Then add sharpen and add zoom blur. So first just take zoom blur and make this 0.3 and make this 0.2 or 3 it's up to you i like 0.2 in this clip it depends on what clip it is but yeah and then change this to 0.5 maybe so now you're left with these two so you have this and this those are some really really good thumbnails and right, now when you wanna uh because like it's a clip now so then go into color and grab still then it will be up here and change the export just choose a choose a folder and change it to jpeg files and just name it whatever you want. Uh, uh, insane thumbnail or something, just like that. And that's how you render it as a uh, as a picture. Uh, you can see um, I have it uh, um, so just right here. You can see here. That's how it looks like. It's gonna be a bit weird. It's gonna be bad quality, but uh, when it, once it's like uh, turned down, when it's made smaller, it's you don't really notice it. So just you can see you don't really notice it. So yeah. That's how you do it. All right. So I will uh, see you in the next video tomorrow. All right.